I'm Justus Nischlag and I'm here to defend the Arena Champion title. And to win Rotterdam was quite uh, cool, uh, so it was really special for me. In stage one I felt confident but uh, tried to go not too hard and I was kind of in the middle field and uh, stage two I was able to win. It uh, was really surprising me, so I was uh, yeah, trying to go all out on the last stage and I think on the last one I got fourth and uh, in total it was enough to win uh, the first arena games. It was amazing. Uh, the intensity of that format is uh, huge. So uh, in the first stage it's like a normal triathlon but uh, with each stage it's getting harder and harder and in the end it's just all about surviving. So <laughs> I never give up and fight until the finish line. structure is uh, nearly every week the same. So I have uh, five sessions of swimming and four sessions uh, of biking and um, yeah, all in total I'm training 25 to 30 hours a week. I think it's around 20 to 25 kilometers in swimming, um, around 300 on the bike and 50 to 70 kilometer on the run and some gym and uh, athletic stuff. The last weeks before arena games looked like um, I'm getting up at about 6 in the morning and uh, going for a sunrise run. I'm not the early bird but uh, sometimes you have to get up early. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm eating like nearly everything and I don't drink coffee but uh, I have my hot chocolate. <laughs> I love it and uh, yeah. And after breakfast we have uh, swimming at about noon and after the swim I will take a lunch and uh, after that I will go for a bike ride. Uh, between the sessions I just try to refill as fast as possible and twice a week I try to do some yoga sessions and um, yeah Otherwise, I just try to relax, uh, lying on the couch, reading a good book, um, watching films, um, stuff like that, that and uh, yeah, try to recover as fast as possible. That's my typical day. Um, I know Justus already for nine years and we worked together since seven years now. Justus is now quite an experienced athlete. He's really professional, really looking um, every day that his schedule fits to the training, to the recovery. And um, he's really focused, really a competition guy who, who can sometimes bring uh, results or uh, performances what you cannot see uh, in the training process, but that come really just on, on race day. And for sure he can win uh, again the Super League event. My, my race strategy is uh, top secret and uh, <laughs> I think it's just important to be consistent on all stages. To succeed at your arena games, you must have the perfect combination of aerobic endurance because it's still not just an anaerobic effort, it's still an aerobic effort, but for sure you also need this anaerobic engine. And so you, you need the speed, the power, uh, and also the right tactics to win uh, in the end. So that's why it requires um, a lot of different skills. In the swim we always start with a short warm-up, like two or three hundred meters and afterwards we're doing some drills and it's uh, three to four times a week so I think it's quite a lot 
but I think also think it's important for a good catch and a good stroke uh, to be fast on the swim. For the arena games, I prepare uh, with some threshold sets like um, five by two hundred, and uh, I really love those uh, speed work. You have to go all out, but clever. So um, just uh, stay around uh, your threshold, and then you're fine because the race is short, but uh, you have three stages. So it's uh, short, but also uh, long because you have to do it three times. For the arena games, uh, I try to get used to the curved treadmill, but I'm not using the curved one for my intervals. I'm just uh, warming up uh, before my strength training and uh, just try to get used to the special run. Yeah, run running on a curved treadmill is uh, different to a normal one. Um, it's really, really tough um, to uh, yeah get it moving and um, yeah, I think it's uh, even harder than, than a normal treadmill. I think for the arena games it's quite important uh, yeah, to do some sessions on Swift, uh, to get used to drafting on Swift and uh, also the sprint finish is quite important. Uh, for, for the arena games uh, my favorite session on the bike is a sprint set, so doing several sets of 5 by 8 seconds with 2 minutes uh, rest in between. League format is, is quite interesting for the spectators but also for the athletes it's, uh, it's a lot of speed action you always have different developments during the race I, I think that this format could really be um, a part of the triathlon world yeah I got a lot of attention especially in Germany and uh, yeah I think it's good for for the German triathlon Make sure to subscribe our channels and never miss out on the pro action.